<laughs> I'm a redhead. Anyways, this is Renee Paris Audrey in the color Copper Glaze. And this is part of their Paris High Fashion Collection. I'm going to do a little spin for you so you can see the back. And the sides. You can see that this is sort of angled a little bit longer in the front and it goes forward with a little bit of a shorter, shorter, more tapered nape. And I just love how the fibers just come forward, how it just lays along the face, how it frames the face. I love the bangs. Surprisingly, my husband loves this color. <laughs> He just absolutely loves the color. You can tuck this behind your ears if you are a person that likes to wear a wig behind your ears or your bio hair behind your ears, which I often do. So it looks absolutely great like this. Let me tell you a little bit about the dimensions. The front, the banks are about 4.75 inches. The crown itself is a little over, right around six inches, I think, which gives you a beautiful lift in the crown. And it also then tapers down to the nape, which is 2.25. I think when you have a crown that is like that's a perfect size length to me, you know, six inches, because it gives you a little bit of a lift with not over the top permatease. The weight is 2.8 ounces. This color is, it's sort of a, a medium to, it's a medium blend and a dark blend, dark copper red, light copper red, I should say, blend, 50-50 blend. So while it doesn't have a root, while it isn't considered highlighted, the blend of those two copper colors just really gives you such a pretty look. I think it's really cute. So copper glaze, really pretty. I'm gonna insert the cap right now so you can see what it looks like inside. This is definitely a basic cap. I would consider the fibers to be more medium in denier. This is not shiny at all, surprisingly. It might look a little bit more shiny right now because of the lights inside, but it has a really nice closed rose lace top. So there's no lace front, there's no monofilament top, but it has that rose closed lace top and it also has rose lace ear tabs which is really nice with thin wire stays and the fibers are sewn all the way into the ear caps. This is considered a medium, considered average. I have a circumference of 22 inches around. My face is 9 inches long so I have a pretty long face. If your face is shorter this will look longer on you than it does on me, but if you are a gal that likes red or you want to explore a vibrant, rich color like this, you can't go wrong. This is often on sale. You know, you can, you can pick this up for a pretty reasonable price, I believe, because it is a basic cap. There is no bells and whistles. There is some permatease. You can feel the permatease all along here, but I think the permatease is needed. And even though there is no lace front, you're not going to be pulling this up off. You can push it back a little bit. So basic cap, no lace front, no monofilament. It does have permatease, guys, but it needs it. I think the permatease enhances the shape of this wig without a doubt. So this is beautiful casual. This is a workhorse wig. This is every day. You know, not heat-friendly fibers, synthetic fri fibers. I think it holds, it holds up really well. I think this is just a great everyday look. I'm going to show you some pictures taken on the outside. I took these last week. So you can see this is me just walking around the backyard. You can get a little bit of an idea of what it looks like with the sun shining on it and some clouds. I think this is super, super, super sweet. This wig was sent to me complimentary from Wig Studio One in exchange for a review where I'm blessed to be a guest reviewer on Wig Studio One. And this is one of the pieces that I was sent so I could try it because I probably would never buy this 
originally because of the color. But what a surprise, copper glaze. Thank you so much to Wig Studio One for gifting this to me so that I could review it. So if you're interested in trying it, don't be afraid to buy it. Look at these colors. Look at how rich it looks. Beautiful fibers. Medium in denier. Not super fine, but not heavy, not thick. I just think an overall very, very realistic, real looking piece. It, and it passed Jay's approval rating. He actually says, I really like that on you. He said that a number of times. So I'll link all the information below. Again, this was sent to me complimentary from Wig Studio One in exchange for a review.